Good morning everybody. Today we are going learning about mixed numbers and improper fractions. So yesterday we learned that a mixed number is a whole number with a fraction. An example is two and one quarter. An example of an improper fraction is where the numerator is bigger than the denominator. An example is nine over four. The numerator is bigger than the denominator. Today we're going to look at an example of how to change a mixed number into an improper fraction again. If we look at question one today, we can see that we're trying to turn two and one third into an improper fraction. And how we do this is we take the denominator and multiply it by the whole number. So we go three multiplied by two, which equals six. We then take this answer and we add it to our numerator. So we then go six plus one equals seven. We then take this and we then take this answer seven and we put it over our denominator. So therefore that becomes seven over three. So two and one third equals seven over three or seven thirds. Today we are also going to learn about changing from improper fractions back to mixed numbers. Let's look at an example here. Let's look at 11 over 3. How we do this is we divide 11 by 3. So go 11 divided by 3 equals 3 remainder 2. We then, we do not write it as 3 remainder 2. We write our whole number down 3 and we then take a remainder of 2 and put it over our denominator. So 3 and 2 thirds. So 11 over 3 equals 3 and 2 thirds. Let's look at an example now. Let us look at question 17 in today's work, which is to change 2 and something over 7 equals 18 over 7. We do not know this mixed number, but we know our improper fraction. So we work backwards to find our missing number here. So we there go with 18 over 7. We go 18 divided by 7 equals 2 remainder 4. And again, we write down our whole number then but we put a remainder over our denominator. So that becomes two and four over seven. We then fill in our missing answer up here, which is four. So therefore, two and four over seven equals 18 over seven. 